So we're in Clovis, California, just finished installing a cooler simmer on toilet, and that's separate than the seat that you see here. Um, we pulled out the old toilet. The flange was in good shape. Uh, no corrosion down there. Solid ABS plastic. The soil pipe was sticking out of the flange about a quarter to a half an inch, and we don't like that, so we did cut that off first. And then we gave you some new bolts in there, some new quarter inch by two inch or two and a half inch bolts, brass bolts. <clears throat> Put those in there. A couple wax rings set the bowl and then we got some shims around here uh the concrete dips about in this area right here kind of dips down which leaves kind of a gap in here it's tight at the back <clears throat> tight at the front just some gaps on each side so we like to fill those just so you don't have uh so just so you have some support in there so on both sides you've got those uh filled in <clears throat> and then we got the tank set water hooked up and uh you know tested it for flushing uh, so it, it flushes correctly, fills correctly, shuts off correctly. So that part is good. And then, of course, we're looking back here right now. You can see no water. You want to monitor this over here. You know, you've got a lot of connections now as opposed to a standard uh, toilet. You've got um, a little T up there that mounts to the fill valve that comes over to this washlet. And then, of course, the water underneath. So three different points of connection there. So just keep an eye on those. This is the Toto washlet. I think it's the S300E. And uh, we don't know much about this unit. We've set these, oh, I'm going to say probably about six years ago, we set a bunch of these for our customer here in town. But as far as functionality, I know that it's got heated dry. It's got an instant uh, water heater in there to get you the water temperature you're looking for. Rear wa wash, front wash. I'm not sure if it makes french fries or not, but... Uh, whatever you've got in here, uh, it's all controlled by this remote. And so uh, I remember the last time we were setting these inadvertently, I hit a button with this up and it came out and squirted me. So I'm a little gun shy with these guys. But um, anyway, so that's a nice little product there. Uh, toilet, we set a lot of these, the Cimarron. Uh, so the Kohler Cimarron, this is straight out of Lowe's. And uh, it's a great toilet, uh, class five flushing technology anyway so uh, it was told you know that at some point they're gonna come here and do a little remodel so when you get ready just you know be gentle especially with this washlet this is a, a real uh, high dollar item there's just a little clip on that little button right here on the side you can see it right 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 there so this guy right here that little button you just press it in and it unlocks the seat and then you just pull the seat right out of course you got to unplug it and uh, you know disconnect this one water line back here and uh, and then you can slide that whole seat off and put it in a nice uh, blanket and protect it because this is a you know pretty high dollar item. anyway so everything here looks good outside of that this installation is done